First things first, trading can be stressful. I mean, you're watching your hard earned money go up and down with the market and it can be hard to stay calm. But trust me, the key to successful trading is to have a clear head and make logical decisions, not emotional ones. And it's not just about staying calm, it's about having a strategy. That's why this class is going to be going over trading psychology strategies. I met a Matt, director of education at Penny Boys University and welcome to class number 10 of Penny Boys University Lite. Make sure to check the description in this video for the handout as well as the class video game. you don't want to be like a chicken running around without a head in the stock market, right? That's why it's important to have a clear set of rules and stick to them. This can help you make decisions based on logic rather than emotions. For example, if you set rules for when to enter and exit a trade or how much you're willing to risk on a single trade, that is limiting risk. Another strategy is to use a journal to track your trades. This can help you identify patterns in your behavior and make adjustments when necessary. For example, if you tend to trade emotionally when you are tired or when you just got off from work or hungry and are seeing losses as a result, you can adjust accordingly and take a break Break from trading when you aren't in the right mindset for it. And if things aren't going as planned, don't panic. Just adjust your strategy and keep moving forward and give your plan time to breathe before scrapping or changing it. Just because two trades don't work out does not mean the plan is bad. All you know, the next eight trades will work out, but you also don't want to beat a dead horse. So humility is key in trading. So knowing the balance of when to tweak a plan you made and when to be patient is important. Your sanity matters when it comes to trading. So it's recommended to take breaks and do things that make you happy. And don't forget to celebrate your wins because trading can be like an emotional roller coaster, and you have to enjoy the good moments. If you're feeling overwhelmed or emotional, step away from the computer and do something you enjoy. This can help you clear your head and come back to trading with a fresh perspective. The stock market isn't going anywhere, but if you trade when your head isn't on straight, your money can. If you enjoyed this Penny Boys University Lite class, be sure to check out our free five class trading psychology course in our free Discord and ask about our premium trading classes while you're there. I hope to see you all there, but as always, until then, I hope that you all make some bread.